coming in. Seems like it's gonna be me and Tanana not today. Need to grab my ukulele. <laughs> And if y'all don't know why I am grabbing my ukulele, uh, if you follow us, I sing you a song. And that's, uh, that's a good reason to come and tune in live. The hours are weird, but uh, we have fun here, so yeah. Um, anything you missed from yesterday is I tried to make a really good god bow. And... Uh, it does decent. I have to find something to shoot. Knife the fuck out of a, out of a sheep. Um, this isn't our actual bow. I I do sadly have to get rid of it. But um, yes, that's about it when it comes to stuff. Love you still redecorating. Yeah. I want to test this on someone. It's not the pig. Because poor pig just gets sniped. And like, did. did. Barber number one. Barber number two. Oh, I missed barber number two. Why are you shooting the barbers? You know how many there are? Alright, fine, I won't, I won't shoot it, but I will shoot the giant skeleton. Okay, so it does one shot the giant skeleton. It's good to know. Why are there so many barbers? Huh. Anyway, uh, we're going to be trying to go for this, except for we're going to be going for a short bow. But yeah, this is this is what we're looking at when it comes to the uh, the stuff here. Anyway, we're gonna throw this back, as well as the everything in here. And I believe loadout five is what we had. Yep, this looks like our stuff. Cool. We can go ahead and delete loadout five. I don't know what I want to do today. Oh, I need to look for your hammer. Because I think you said I might have it. Yeah, I've checked everywhere, but I can't. Uh, oh, I was going to do uh, applied energistics today. Oh, it looks like Nick is going to be joining us here. Okay, so last time we figured out... Oh, yes, that's right. So we figured out how to do mine camp. I ran our, I ran our thing and we can... Oh my god, I forgot we beat the Ender Dragon last night. Okay. Did you record that? Yeah, I did. Or at least streamed it, I think. Oh, thank you for reminding me. I need to go grab those streams. Hmm? I need to grab the streams from... Sorry everyone, you're gonna be staring at my uh, whatever it's called for a little bit. I just need to grab these two episodes.
All right, there we go. Oh, I have stone bricks for you. Never said I needed them. But do you want them? Because I don't want them. No, no, Okay, just let me know. Um... Why don't we make a Tinker's Construct... Uh, so much stuff to do that I could do. I'm at like a kind of a cross... railroad crossing here, like... I could... Um, head towards more tech stuff. Or I could head towards some more... Um, whatever it's called. Magic stuff. Which do you think? Probably the magic, so take that how you will. Mm -hmm. If you want to be a part of us, do the same, you know, roughly the same thing. Wait, you're probably the one that's going to get us to a planet first. If you like the... Oh, yeah, I mean, I think. Oh, I forgot. We have story stuff we're supposed to be doing too for Scotty. So I guess while we think on that. Why don't I just go strip mining, maybe? Actually, hold on. First, we're going to... We need to find a... Or I need to find a silicon press. You need to find one? Yeah, you can't make it. They're in the meteors. I hate the find-only stuff. Yeah, I do too. I'm 100% I'm with you on that. It ruined the immersion. Of just having to go find it. Well, it's... Of having to fucking build it yourself. That's the, my favorite part. Well, you still build a lot. Still, it's just like... You have to find four things. That one thing that's out of your control, it haunts me. Yeah, that's fair. I guess you wouldn't really... I mean... Oh, we could also do Tinker, or not Tinker's Construct, the, what's it called? Twilight Forest and Coliseum. We could just make today like a story stuff day after you're done remodeling. Hey, it's not so much when I'm done, it's when I get sick of it. That's fair. But does that sound dope? I guess so. Then we can know. just go story building. Uh, that is also another concern. I can load in some schematics, bring back the one that we used in uh, whatever it's called. And Aldasta season one. Oh, I was also looking at um, season one of Val. Dasta, and I made like some notes on it. Like, this is also a really pretty biome. I don't know why, I just like snow. I was like, oh, hi. A little pretty biome. You're so pretty. Oh, hey, there's a thing. Um, but, what was I trying to say? Man, ADHD just like went, said hello. Y'all didn't see that. Hey! So that's it, I think. It's small. I remember what I wanted to do. I know I've said this like six billion times. I wanted to get an angel ring today. That's why I brought up fighting the wither. Mm, yeah. Oh, apparently I'm not missing it. Which which press am I missing?
I'm missing the engineering press. Fudge. I don't even think it's like worth it to carry that press. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave it there. I wanna be the very best. No one ever was. Catch them as my real test. Train them as my cars. Pokemon. Okay. So I think, would I be able to use your enchantment table if I gave it right back to you? Why do you need to take it? Also, I need to get those books. Yes, yes we do. Um, the division sigil? Mm -hmm. Or not division? Is it division sigil? I think it's called. Hold on, I'm just gonna look up sigil. Yes, it is the division sigil. Um, so to activate it, you have to like once it hits midnight, you have to click it and then kill something on top of the uh, whatever it's called on top of like the ritual area, and that allows you to kind of that activates the thing. That's really cool generation. Um, if that makes any sense at all. No. Ooh, mine shaft. Doesn't smile. That's fair. It's valid. I have to check that out later. Oh, man. So way back in the mind, got my pickaxe moving from side to side, side, side to side. Hello, tree. You're a nice tree. You can also get to tier 3 in blood magic to take. So many options. I think I've somehow... Yep, I did. Yep. Yep, I did. Somehow looped myself back to the portal. <laughs> server might be laggy, so might the stream be. Uh, it is trying to gener- it's trying to download yesterday's ser or streams. Oh, that's some tanked. Man, if that area wasn't tainted, look at how cool this would be. You don't like the spot? I can't tell much about it. Well, it's like in the middle of this dark oak forest, and it's just a small, like, one chunk flower plain biome.
Okay, I feel like I have to build here. Come on, this is like a perfect area. Alright, I'll mark it. I get that that's probably like just glitched terrain generation, but that looks super cool. There's a whole bunch of like small flower biomes just in the extreme hills area. And so it's creating these like, uh, bah, bah, bah. it's creating these uh, small little pockets in the uh, In the train. Uh, some logic. Don't need it though. All these volcanoes are just really cool. Meteor like number five. Let's see if you have what I need. I think that's the one I need. That's engineering. There we go. Hells yeah. I just need to get a whole bunch of service cords.
axe. I want something sweet. I'm sure that would be sweet. You want peanut butter? Oh yeah, we do have peanut butter. Peanut butter. Break my sweet tooth, but don't break my tooth. Dry is done. All right, I have enough books to make 72 bookshelves. I think you only need 30 though. Oh, I disconnected, that was my bad. That was the wrong button, don't worry. Can I not do it? Sure. Thank you, lovey. No need to get wood at some point.
Okay. I'm coming with shelf. I'm teleporting you, okay? Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Where are we? Oh, we're underneath the tree. I'm just looking at the top of the tree. Alright, All right, so where is you wanting your bookshelves? Is this where you want your enchantment table? No, but it's nothing else is finished. So, I mean, I can. Wood is pretty is, uh, cheap. So. The books are the only annoying part. I just move it later. Because I haven't found enough cows and I really hate killing the horses. That's 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 fair. Ah, beans. Beans. Also, would you tell um teleport let me teleport to that um library so I can get the rest of the bookshelves? Yes, yeah, sure. <laughs> Look at the enchantments I just got on that. Interesting. So is that all the bookshelves? That it yeah, you, oh, this is all you need for a level 30 enchant. Okay. And then I will be right there. Yeah, let me let me get you to book, and then I'm going to go back to Forest Haven. You can teleport to me whenever you want. Not wait for one second, not yet. Oh, it's so bare. Is there more? Oh, yeah, this is the chest that has heads in it, isn't it? Yep. Flare. Uh, it's near spawn. Just looking for six wood so I can replace this stupid bookshelf. Mm. I think I took all the wood out. We have blood wood. Yeah, we're... Mm. Are you okay with one having a different wood type? Because you're going to break it eventually. Sure, it's fine. What? Excuse me, I placed you. You're play. What? Don't ask. What? Weird things happen in my play, okay? <sighs> okay, we try again.
All right, we go outside. Let's go outside. Oh my. Oh my. Yeah, it's leg. Just a bit of leg. There we go. Oh my! Hi! Liking now? Well, now it's actually there. I mean, before it wasn't. It was not. <laughs> okay. Nothing in there. Um, here's the short bow. Alright, so I feel like we can accomplish a couple different things today. Yeah, before we switch over to some stuff, I do need to figure out what is used for beheading. I'm sorry, what? Uh, getting the beheading thing. Mm. It's a modifier that lets you... Kill one trick? No, um, that lets you, uh, shoot, oh my gosh, it's a uh, higher, higher chance to drop heads. There's an ender pearl and an obsidian, I think I have both though, actually I don't have an ender pearl, I know for a fact I don't. Yeah, melted them all. Yep, yeah, I did. But damn, that reactor runs like a beauty. It is a fucking beast, man. I just have to find... Ooh, I know where I can go. Duh. Forest Haven has everything. Death, destruction, and infinite food. We're looking for a tall boy. And I am going to save half of these books for Nick, and I know he wanted some. Aw, that's nice of you. Yeah. Hello. Great little boy. Next time you forget to go up there. Even though he probably forgot. <laughs> he probably did forget. I have one more modifier left on my cleaver. Mm -hmm. I do. Good. Also good to know I have one... One obsidian. Exactly one. Way to go.
All right, now it's time to go to the room. Not, like my sinuses, like they're building up pressure, like right behind, right here. It like mm. feels like I need to sneeze. Yeah, it's not the most pleasant thing, but there's also a lot worse. Yeah, there's a lot worse. It's just kind of annoying. Not even. It, sorry, kind of understand. It's just really annoying. <laughs> Okay. Let's actually head this way. Are the pigs still mad at me? Oh, it's a hungry zombie pig man. I hear the wisp. I ain't gonna fuck with all that. We're just looking for some wither skelly boys. Only the skelliest of wither boys. Should I pick up all that nether wart I just passed? Um, I don't need it. You don't? Okay. Oh, hi! The calculator. The calculator all the books that I just took from that freaking fortress. Uh -huh. I got 474 books. Damn. Yep. Nick will be happy, because I know I am. That's cool as hell. I know! And with all these experience bushes that you so graciously um, bestowed upon all of us, I can enchant everything. You can enchant everything. Don't worry, I do. I use it for good.
looks like all the bookshelves are the same color. Oh, I fixed it. Hmm. I chopped some trees. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. I need to know which is better odds. The uh Well okay, so I have a thirty percent chance to behead. I have to go back again. Okay, I'll continue talking to myself. That's fine. I mean I was talking to you. <laughs> What'd she do? No, she just decided to hang out really cute though. Uh I don't know. Do you need me to call it? Oh, no, there it is. Okay. I'm just getting this spell. Ah, 31. Alright. What is the... Okay, never mind. I had a way to mine that really efficiently. I so would. For use in trolling later. What's the thing? That's a, that's a surprise tool that we'll use later. Oh shit, is that not? Stupid bats come into my house, sleep on my couch. Then you decide to explode in my fucking face. How dare you, sir, ma'am, it, thing, whatever you are, wasp fuck. I don't know. <sighs> okay. Nope, nope, I hear you. Oh, hi, buddy. Ah, oh, fuck off. Did I just straight up give me cobalt? Alright. That didn't, though. What? What? Alright. Let's grab some more calendrite. 
Of course, we'll always grab this quartz. Um, anything else that looks useful? This R die definitely looks useful. Why is Ardite so rare? I need to figure out which one, how, like, how to combine manual one properly. Um, or, like, what to combine to get manual in. Because I don't know. Where are you? Jesus. Salt Peter. All right, so into this fire, I shall cast away the items that I do not want. Uh, oh, hey, we did get a water skeleton skull. Fuck this. Fuck this. Fuck this. Fuck this. Ah, fuck this. Throw away for Xyz. That's a pretty gloss. Sulfur. Another Xyz skull. Oh. All right, sup, bro? All right, sup, bro? Why did that Ardite not mine?
Why is our diet so hard to fucking find? I have three Ardite to five Cobalt. You know what? Let's throw that in there. We'll see what we get. Oh, that's fair. Except protected. Either that or whenever I have a bra and have shoes on. Oh. <laughs> both or not. That's fair. Yeah. Okay, I'm ready to start making books like this now tomorrow. Tomorrow? I feel like it's almost always nighttime. Yeah, it is nighttime fairly often. Like, I think it's 50 50. Maybe. Just do a bit. I like how everyone now knows about Scotty's, like, hidden thing. Yeah! <laughs> like, that he obviously took time to make somewhat secretive. Yeah. <laughs> so, six ingots of manulin. Oh, shit, really? And it only cost. All right. What do you need? La the lapis lazuli for? Uh, well, you'll need it. You need it in like future updates to enchant. You don't need it there. Here, it's really only used for, to my knowledge, getting fortune. Mm -hmm. By the way, if you get two soulbound books, I will so trade you. What's that? Uh, soulbound is when you die, it stick. Oh wait, I guess I don't need that. Yeah, no. But what was it? Um. What am I about to say? Uh, it makes it to where you're you don't lose that item upon death. Oh wait, I guess I still need the arrowhead too, don't I? So is Nick feeding on? I'm sure he will at some point. He just hasn't even... He hasn't texted us yet. Mm 
Just need to get some slime balls. I told you they're uh, oh, sorry. the. Oh man! No, I'm going to blank on it. I don't remember. Oh, they they allow you to keep your items after death. Scotty and I owe you. See if he has any slime balls. Mm. Or do you have any? I think I have two. I don't think that'd be enough. If you don't need them. Well, yeah, I need them because I need magma cream. You get those from killing the magma cubes. Huh? You can get those from killing the magma cubes. It's alright, I can go find the Tinker's Construct Island. Okay. I appreciate it. There's one near your farm area, right? What? Slime Island? are actually kind of a pain because you know the levels I'm not sure it wouldn't be a better idea to just get a whole bunch of like level one books I mean that's that's up to you because otherwise I'm just going to be using a bunch of also, what is Silk Touch for? It allows you to keep the block in whatever state you get it in. Mm. I can see how that's cool. Yeah, it's uh, basically the only way to uh, legitimately get ice, grass, a um, couple other things. Let us head back to Port Codex. We have the fletching thing yet. Do you have any idea what a wrecking enchantment is for? What a what? 
wrecked. No, I don't. How the hell do I make a slime crystal? Huh. Good to know. There is fall damage, right? Yeah. Why? Uh, I didn't, haven't taken any so far. You know, just in the game that you I. You have the angel ring. Oh yeah. That's why. But I've like fallen. Grab some slimy mud. I needed books for more than just enchanting, but... Hmm. Uh, a lot of magic mods will use books for a lot of different things. I know in Ars Magica... I kill the... Or Sheeple here. I'm sorry, you have to be Marathard. It is for the great are good. I promise you for the great are good. I got two out of the like. I think it was four I need.
Where's the four I need? Just in case I need some more, let's... Where are the rest of you on the floor? I don't know. a whole bunch of essence berries, but they haven't showed up in my inventory. They will. Server's being really laggy. Mm. I apologize. Fudge. I never hear. Can I test my bow on you? No. It won't kill you, I don't think. Oh. Alright, I shall test it on Cheeple. Well, it doesn't have damage to kill shape. That's right. I need to put moss on this bad boy.
I feel like I have another moss ball somewhere just laying about. Actually, it looks like I don't. Okay, so let's grab all my nether quartz, grab my coal. Redstone, that boy up. Okay. By the way, I don't have your hammer. That's a problem. That just seriously crashed. Damn. Well, give it a sec. Should I call Nick again?
Uh, I didn't pick up again. That looks pretty cool. Are you going into the tree? Mm -hmm. Nice! That honestly does look really cool. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, is that Nick calling me? Hello! Hey, you know, it, a lot of the times, if you when you call me, like, if you, if you don't immediately end it, if you stay in the call for, like, 30 seconds, I will jump. I never know, because always the times when I stay, like, a lot of the times when I do stay, it's always Clyde, and then all the times when I just leave, you're always like, what the fuck? So, you know... Child, child you know what time I work. Yeah, but you were lazy, like, for a good... Week before you went to Bradenton. Yeah, I mean this is true, but now I went to Bradenton and I spent like four hundred dollars while I was on vacation, and now I need to actually work. Gotcha, gotcha. That makes sense. <laughs> I have made an amazing bow, and I'm going to completely wreck your face. Why are you gonna wreck my face? I didn't do anything. Uh, I don't know if I actually will wreck your face. It's just a thing to say to wreck your face. Oh, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. <laughs> I, thought, I thought you were going to say, I don't know about that. I was like, what do you think? I legitimately did nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you have a shit ton of books in your house now. The, the, the whole time, I have done nothing that has been detrimental to anybody, and you keep telling me I did things. So this one needed two modifiers? Oh, that's sad. Nick, I need to know how much damage your bow does, and I would like to test it on you if that's alright. Fine. It's for science. Completely. Um, my Minecraft is loading. I'll let you know when I'm in. Well, you'll see it when I pop in. Yes, I will. You have a shit ton of books waiting for you in your house. Oh, yeah. Hannah hooked you up with books. Oh, cool. Thank you. You have okay. 237? I don't know. Mm. <coughs> 237 books. It will, it will take a little while, but I will make you a god sword. Hi. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. I mean, I know you're playing technically in creative, and you can just give yourself one whenever, but I feel like you don't know how to, so I'm going to give it to you as a gift. Yeah. The only thing I do in creative is experiment. Because I enjoy the uh, grind part. Oh, yeah. Alright, so uh, yes, I will, uh, I will, in exchange for this... Uh, I will eventually, once I once I have the full capability to do so, I will make you a god sword. Yeah. Um, and believe it or not, these books are very instrumental in doing so, which Daniel knows how. Hmm. That, is, that is true. Oh my gosh, I've been trying to enchant the books for the last 30 minutes. It is so annoying. Yeah. Uh, do you want some uh, extra experience? I have been stealing your berries, and it still takes freaking oh, forever. Oh. I, I know, I mean, uh, you, you don't have to steal the berries. The berries are free for everyone, but I have a stockpile of, like, five or six stacks of those berries that I can just give you so you don't have to keep coming and picking them. Mm. Mm. Uh, maybe. The market's off of people's laziness. <laughs> Honestly, if you're interested, <laughs> I think I'm sick of these books, and I'll give you the rest of mine if you want them. I mean, okay. <laughs> well, 
how how are you going about it? Like, do you have a fully stacked enchanting table? Yeah. Yep. Is that the problem? All right. Um, what you want to do normally is only use enough berries at one time to get up to level thirty, and then enchant a book and use more. But you will get so many more books without having to refill out of, out of it that way. Because basically, the the higher level you go, the uh, the worse, uh, like, or like the, the, the more it takes to gain another level. Yeah. But you need at least 30 to get max level enchantments. Yeah. Like, here, uh, I can help you out with this. What are you trying to get? Um, I don't know. I just know there's a lot of enchantments, and I was going to collect all of the good ones. Oh, I mean, there are a lot, like, I mean, I guess the, the best thing I can tell you is start with a piece of gear in mind. Like, what, what are you trying to achieve? A weapon, armor, bow, a fishing rod? What are you trying to enchant? Uh. <laughs> you know, give me a goal. You just have to depict one, you know? That's the problem, also. I see. Um, well, if you don't really know, then honestly, the best uh, enchantment to try and go for first, in my opinion, is protection. Oh, yeah. I have a couple of those, yeah. Oh, I've fallen into the world. Um, okay, well, one thing that is important for you to know uh, is you don't have to get, like, protection four on a single book. Um, like if you have protection one, put that on a, uh, put that on a chest plate, plate. and then, uh, if you have prote another protection one, that will upgrade it to protection two, and then you need another protection two to upgrade it to protection three, and so on and so forth. Like, you, you build them up together, like, don't, uh, don't try and get the best enchantment straight out of the gate. Like, add add levels together to make it the best enchantment. Yeah, I don't know how to repair uh, armor and weapons. So. Uh, you need an anvil. I do have one. Anvil and then like materials. Oh. Okay, so yeah. Literally, uh, yeah. If you have an iron sword or a diamond sword, just put the same material in the slot to repair it. Um... But once you start enchanting, uh, I will tell you, the most important enchantment you can possibly get is mending. Because once you enchant your stuff, you cannot repair it. Anymore. You need mending to make sure it doesn't break out. Oh, that. mending's not in this, because it's not one point. It's, it's not high uh, enough version. We're below, we're below 1.12. That means we can repair enchanted things, though, right? Yeah. Okay, so all of what I just said was for 1.12 or later. Fuck that shit. Ah. Also, can I shoot you? Uh, yes. I'm a full health, wearing no armor. Okay. More, more than ten hearts. Uh, I killed you. Yes. yes. <laughs> Hold on. It does 21 hearts of attack damage. Oh, motherfucker, you didn't need to <laughs> shoot me if it said it on the thing. Yeah, but I didn't know how that, like, translates. I mean, with armor, there's a complicated calculation. You can look up a calculator online. Yeah, and I just did not want to have to deal with that calculator, so I just wanted to I'm, shoot you. I'm not wearing any armor right now, so there was no point in shooting me. I mean... Eh? Uh, yes, so... You can repair enchanted things, ignore the whole last part, but still... I believe in this version you could still uh, up enchantments by stacking with the same, uh, a book of the same tier, right? Yeah. Pretty sure. There you go. That's your, that's my payment for you, for letting me shoot you in the face. What'd you give him? A ball of moss. Huh. I appreciate it. I'm, I'm going to need quite a few of these as I continue to make tools. Yeah. I'm working on my pickaxe next. Uh, but uh, Hannah, just for your reference, the way this the way this god sword works, 
is there is a uh, there is a material you could make called magical wood, which starts with the same exact stats as a wood sword, so garbage. Uh, the 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 trick to it though is that um, when you uh, use magical wood with Tinker's construct, it can accept up to eleven modifiers, uh, which is seven or eight more than the next highest material. Hmm. No, it's 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 a, it's six more than the next highest. Uh, Eight higher than iron or gold or diamond. The average is about three modifiers for majority. Yeah, the average is three, yeah. uh, and then certain things like paper weapons um, get extra thomium weapons get extra some some things get uh, extra modifiers, but magical wood gets like six to eight more than most things. <laughs> So you start with a basic wooden sword, and then you add, like, sharpness 8, and mending 2, and 3 durability increases, and <laughs> looting fo 5, and, like, all kinds of crazy shit, you know? Yeah, so, but I can't repair them, right? Like, I uh, the, the magic wood sword, uh, the one that I'm going to make you repairs itself. Right, so I should probably make things for itself. That's actually what the moss balls that Daniel gave me is for. Those are the items that add auto repair to uh, to tools. Hmm. Well, I guess I better go collect moss balls because I'm not going to enchant things just to have them break. I mean, I will. Uh, I will give you a. Uh, a rundown on how Tinker's Construct works, so that's separate from enchanting, though. Uh, for enchanting, you can still repair them. What I was talking about was, I was thinking of a later version. You can repair them in this version when they're enchanted. Hmm. I didn't know. Yeah. Well, I guess... Oh, man. Spiral staircases are a bitch! <laughs> But yeah, so like, say you have a sword that you want to start enchanting. Like, take your sharpness one book that you've gathered so far, put them in a pile. Take your sharpness two books that you've gathered, put them in a pile. Take your sharpness three books that you have, put them in a pile, you know? Yeah, and then start stacking them up. Like, put sharpness one on first, and then another sharpness one to make it two. And then... You know, a two on to make it three, and then a three on to make it four. Or if you don't have a three, you know, combine two twos to make them into a three, you know? Yeah. We do also have over-enchanting, or enchanting plus, on this, uh, on this thing, which means you can actually enchant things to way higher levels than you normally would be able to. But you need the advanced enchanting table for that. Oh, I didn't say that, but I don't remember what it is. I mean, how to make it. Daniel, do you know how to make an advanced enchanting table? Uh, I could look it up real quick. I am looking up stuff to get a nice sword. That's fine. I'm, I'm looking for it here. Hold on. Uh, I'm trying to decide if I want a scythe or. <laughs> Alright, you make oh, oh, I didn't mean to give that to myself I meant to look at the recipe, I keep doing that You need an eye of ender Four blocks of gold, a bucking quill And some obsidian So, like, less stuff than you need to actually Make an enchanting table Yeah, actually Considering you can get enderman, you know Above uh, it is, If you look it up in the thing It's called the enchanting table upgrade You make that and then you click on your table with it, and that lets you enchant things like even higher than they normally are. Nice. That makes me happy. Uh, although I am currently very distracted by trying to make a staircase. Oh yeah, you should. 
Or, I guess, are you willing to unveil what you've been working on? She's remodeling. I mean, I, yeah, I don't care, but it's... <coughs> I mean, you know, I'll come take a look at it, if, if you're okay with it. Oh, yeah, it's not like... It's going to be a work in progress for a while, so there's no point in hiding it. Oh, crap. Hi. <coughs> We both just appeared here. Yeah. I died. Whoa! Oh, no. It's not hard enough to kill me. Okay. <coughs> Ugh. The shadows in the stairs are killing me. More torch. More torch. I will let you know that if you upgrade your enchanting table, you will need more bookshelves. It also increases the max number of bookshelves to the point where you basically have to build a whole sphere around it and then close yourself in for max and shit. <laughs> no, this is, I see, you're, you're starting to build up the trunk of the tree. This is cool. Yeah. <laughs> I'll move the doorway to the staircase and a little jank. So is this going to stay just a potion shop or... Is the second floor going to contain some crazy shit? Is it just going to be your house? What, 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 what is your plan? Um, I think I'm just sticking to mostly witchcraft, so... And witchcraft comes with a bunch of junk, so I'm going to need lots of rooms. <laughs> oh, yeah. If you're going to do witchery, you're going to need an altar room. You're going to need a circle room. Yeah. The altar room is the most important. Have you built your altar yet? Uh, I have a single block. <laughs> okay. Um, you, I think you only need two two altar blocks for the table, right? Two or no, three. it's six what? for the altar. Oh, it's a two by three. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, that makes more sense. That is right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and then you're going to have to go around collecting things. <coughs> Most interestingly, if you want to maximize your magic power for witchery, you're going to need a player head. <laughs> yeah, well, we know where a lot of those are. Yep. Why? Or I can go around with my beheaded thing and try and murder y'all for a head. Also. Well, that, that was what I was implying, is that she was going to have to kill one of us, but... I mean, you could use an NPC player head, or we could fight to the death. I don't know if the NPC player heads count. Oh, uh, they should. They're still player heads. <coughs> fair, fair. What is this? I don't sound cool. A tome of knowledge sharing. What is this? Uh, it's a sonic tinkering. It's oh, like, it's that'd be a good thing for you if you ever wanted to be generous. I think it just shares research. What? Yeah, that is, she just threw it at me. I'm, I'm checking to see. I don't know what it gave me, though. I don't either, but I right-clicked and it said research added or some junk. And I yeah, don't... it said research added, but I'm, I'm looking to see what it added. I'm trying to find it. Ooh, you have taught me about blood magic. Um. You're welcome. And the Wispy Dreamcatcher. What the heck? heck? Um, these are uh, you. You have essentially you have taught me how to uh, how to get involved with both uh, yours and Daniel's main magic systems. That works. Uh, Daniel. Yeah. Do you happen to need some bloody scrivener's tools? Ah, <laughs> uh, I am well away from that. I haven't even got to the tier 2 altar. I've been doing all the tech tree stuff. Yeah. Uh, this is true. Whenever you get back to blood magic, though, let me know. And I can, uh, or, or if you, I guess it's specifically if you ever decide to actually dip your toes in bombcraft. I can give you a, uh, a pen and quill that effectively allows you to use blood magic points instead of having to collect research. Yeah, that's gonna go so fast. Oh my god. <laughs> you don't even know. Um, 
Let me throw some of this stuff into my junk area. I believe, let me read the thing here, yes. You still need one of each aspect required. The rest can be paid with blood magic. Gotcha. So effectively, if you were learning these bloody scrimmage tools, for example, instead of five Victus, five Cognito, and three Census, you would need one, one, and one, and some blood magic points. Gotcha. Well, then, <laughs> that might be what I end up doing. Let's head out to Carefree. No, apparently not. <coughs> We're just gonna, just so it's not, it's not. I mean, effectively, that will, <coughs> later on, once I actually have the stuff to make it, and you actually get back to Blood Magic, that will help you catch up to me a whole lot quicker than it took me to do this shit, you know? Oh, yeah. Right. Uh, do you want to look back, uh, by the way, uh... Nope, I, I haven't even begun to figure out my uh, witchery, so I'm away. All right. I suppose I will hold on to it. I mean, I will I will pass this on to anyone else who is going to do Thalmcraft. You can give it to me. Pass it on to me. I'm Hold on, I won't do that tree. I'm in carry right now, chopping some wood. I think I am going to go ahead and do... Blood. Did I set a waypoint there? I don't think I did. I'll teleport to you. Okay, I'm on top of my blood altar. I uh, start stabbing myself a whole bunch. <coughs> Here you go. The tome not the sharing, just right click that, and then you have no use for it either. But now it's your burden to pass on to the next aspiring vomiter. Oh, I'm not taking it. All right, fine, I'll take it. <laughs> I'll check my I'll check my thalonomicon here. See what I gained. You should have gained, as, as far as I can tell, the knowledge for the Bloody Scrivener's Tools under Apocrypha, and the Wispy Dreamcatcher under Thomic Esoterica. Uh, shared Rings, Apocrypha, Lord of Hellfire. I see. Uh, yeah. Uh, the Lord of Hellfire is a a very, very underwhelming ability if you're expecting something equivalent to its name. It allows you to use a wand to white flammable blocks or uh, to activate portals. Well, that, that is very disappointing. Why would you why would you ruin that for me? Why would you call it the Lord of Hellfire? It's very disappointing. I'm disappointed, Nick. You have disappointed me. I haven't disappointed you, the creators of uh, Apocrypha have. I see. The one that should actually be called the Lord of Hellfire uh, is called uh, the Legions of Hell. And that is a later thing in the same trick. <laughs> I see. That's the one that lets you summon imps and bats. To murder your enemies. Oh, I thought that was called Nine Hells. Uh, no, Nine Hells is the improved version of Legions of Hell. It's the upgraded version. Gotcha. Oh, man, why do I have so much stuff? Oh, Jesus. I have way too much stuff and not enough space. <coughs> I know the feeling. <coughs> you alive there, sir? I'm dying. Well, I can hear that. <coughs> so I actually went and got it checked earlier. I don't have coronavirus like I thought I did. 
I have some sort of completely unrelated upper respiratory infection. Hmm. Wish we knew what we did and didn't have. Yeah, that'd be nice. <clears throat> you guys not have fucking our testing clinics yet? Uh, we, we do. It's just like the rapid test is just complete. Literally, we went there and they were like, yeah, I don't think you have it. Uh, but, <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. The test says you don't have it, but I think you do have it. And we never confirmed it. And then I was like, okay, well, can I get my PCR test done? And she was like, yeah. And then both times I took a PCR, I just have not gotten results. Like, they just didn't, they lost it. They just straight up lost it. Mm, I see. Okay. <laughs> well, for me, they were like, <clears throat> well, you definitely... Are fucking sick, but you don't have coronavirus. Yeah, that's what they told us. And then mm -hmm. they're like, here's here's the options. I mean, I effectively don't have any of the symptoms of coronavirus other than violently coughing myself to death. Ah, uh, I see. Why does that uh, make one? My, the, uh, the, the, uh, the nurse told me that the most likely uh, cause of it was... Uh, when I told her I had been on vacation and everything like that, uh, she was like, how often did you do your laundry? And I was like, at first I was like, that's kind of a personal question. And I was like, I only did it once while I was gone. And she was like, it's probably because your mask is sweaty and fucking nasty. It hasn't been washed in a week. Ah. Uh, like, you know what? That's probably true. <laughs> that, that makes perfect sense. So I effectively gave myself an upper respiratory infection by wearing the same mask for a week without washing it. Mm. I have done that a lot over and I have heard nothing happen to me, so. Mm -hmm. Alright. So. Uh, I, I somehow also doubt that you sweat like I do, though. Uh, well, mm. it, it, it I, happen. I'm a fat guy with fucking Scottish jeans. If it's hotter than 70 degrees outside, I'm going to sweat through, through my shirt in less than an hour. Like, not to mention something that's pressed against my face and neck. Yeah. Fair enough, but <laughs> I shouldn't sweat very much, but if I, there's a medication imbalance, oh my gosh, they, <laughs> it's bad, it's bad. Oh, but yeah. Like, after she mentioned that, like, I just kind of pulled out my mask and was, like, looking at it, and I was like, yeah, you know what? Like, it has been, like, a week since I washed this motherfucker. That's, yeah, I mean, that's, this is a fair thing. And at least one of those days, we were outside playing paintball, and I was wearing it while running in the in 90 degree sun. Well, no, it's it's winter, so it was like seventy eight. <laughs> These are all fair things I'm hearing. Uh, I don't know. So effectively, yes, I, I have random bouts of just fucking dying. As we all. Because I forgot to do my laundry, basically. Nice. Right. You're always suspect, but that's okay. Oh, wait, no, never mind, never mind. I was thinking something else. What the fuck is this place called again? Carrie. Because it's my blood magic place. Yes. I mean, I feel like I should know this by now, but... I'm also very drunk right now. This is all fair things? <laughs> Speaking of, Granny got me a mini fridge. Did she? She she got me a mini fridge for Christmas. It's great. I love that. No, my beer is ice cold. I actually like this. This fridge is a fucking beast. Like I had to turn the thing down. I sent it to Max Cold when I first got it and put it out here. I was like, oh, it's a mini fridge. It won't even be that cold. And then I literally like pulled out a beer to drink it. And poured it into my mouth, and it did that thing where, like, as soon as it's agitated, it freezes. Oh my gosh. 
So I literally got just like pouring beer slushy onto my tongue. I was like, oh shit, this thing gets really cold. <laughs> but beer slushy. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I don't know if that's good or bad. I mean, honestly, it wasn't entirely unenjoyable. It probably would be more enjoyable if it wasn't fucking 30 degrees outside. But, oh, man. but it's better than warm beer, right? <laughs> warm beer is not an option right now. A room temperature at the moment is like 35. Hey, Nick, can I use your blood? Uh, no. Now, that's a personal question. I, 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 got, I got stuff to do that doesn't involve having my blood drawn right now. Sorry. I mean, I at least asked. I mean, you could have just run up to me and started stabbing, but I feel like we have a better relationship than that. Yeah, I feel like we do, too. Oh man, I'm so glad I actually made this bow. This bow is dope as hell, and I can oh, I can upgrade it further. Like this isn't even like the max it can get. I need to look at stuff. Ordo and Humanus. Humanus is Bestia Incognito. Bestia is oh my god! Even without the research, this is so complicated. Just to, just to say it out loud and clearly right now, I need more instrumentum. A lot more. It's required to learn a lot of research. It's one of my aspects. But it is a triple compound aspect, meaning that it is a compound of two compounds. It is... Uh, it is... Uh, it is... Uh, um, Humanus and Ordo. Ordo is actually basic, but Humanus is made of Bestia and Cognito. For Bestia, I need Modus and Victus. Uh, Modus is Air and uh, Victus. Uh, uh, Arrow and Victus. And then Victus is uh, Water and Earth. Uh, And then I also need Cognito, which is another basic Ignis, but combined with Spiritus. Which Spiritus, on its own, is Victus and Mortis, which we already covered. Uh, Victus is Earth and Water, and Mortis is another Victus and Entropis. So effectively, I have to take (coughs) one Fire Essence to every, like, four Water and four Earth and combine them in exactly the right ways, and then they eventually become this bullshit that I need more of right now. I see. Oh, if you've got any fucking tools, or just any random spare material, like if you've got enough gold to just make like a gold shovel, a gold pickaxe, a gold sword, a gold hoe, or if you just have any random tools out of you know, not stone or wood materials laying around that I could scan. That's another way I could get a little bit more just right off the bat, but... Yes, I'm currently I making... Need to, I, mean, I need to study tools in order to uh, to do basically anything. Uh, and that takes, like, 17 steps. So not armor? Just tools? Uh, yes. Armor, specifically, and weapons are a different element. The weapons are Tillum, and armor is uh, Tudamet. Alright, I'm on my way with a golden pickaxe and a shovel. And I have a golden sword. Uh, I will scan it. It won't give me instrumentum. It'll give me Tellum, but I'll still scan it because I haven't scanned one yet. You want to come over here? I'm giving you both of them. Uh, You just don't want them? No, I do not want them. Where the hell did you, why, why do you have them? I just made them for I you, sir. I threw it behind you, by the way, Okay. And I have another yeah. one of those at home, because I got two in the same chest. Alright, well, I see you threw stuff at me, Daniel, but I only have a sword. 
Uh, Hannah, did you pick them up? Or Probably. Them or yes. <laughs> Chug. Chug. You want this sword back? Nope, I have another one. <laughs> Gold swords are actually a good practice for enchanting. Um, yeah, durability yeah. stuff. Uh, I mean, if you can uh, if you can get them uh, unbreaking, they're actually not too bad. But they're they're good practice for enchanting because they take uh, they take more enchantments than other things do. You can try more times the same sword. Yeah. Well, I have that one, and quite a bit of gold because. Okay. I mean, I'll hold on to it then, I suppose. Uh, but uh, thank you guys. Uh, that will help me a little bit uh, with what I need here. But for some reason, this is just the phase that I have reached at this point. Is uh, <coughs> um, basically everything, all of my researches that I want to do require that element, you know? Yeah. Did you already scan a diamond pickaxe? Uh, yes. I have a diamond pickaxe that I scanned. Thank you, though. Uh, a ruby sword? Is that? Oh, wait, tool. You said tool. Didn't you? Yeah, tools is what I'm looking for right now. Weapons are a separate doohickey. Okay, so you yeah. Although it's I'm running very, very low on Ordo as well, which is a basic element. What is it? Hmm? What is it? Ordo, order. Oh. oh uh, the order shards? Yeah, order shards, uh give them and then uh I'm trying to remember what kind of stuff that you can scan for Ordo. It's not super intuitive like a lot of the others. Okay. As far as shards, if you guys find them, uh, I would be uh, greatly willing to uh, to trade whatever whatever I've got for order or air shards. I'm running very low on both of those base elements. Hey, dude, you should go through uh, Scotty's stuff in his basement because I, I think he has a couple things. I mean, I don't want to just take his stuff. You scan it, right? I mean, I can scan stuff, but... The order shards, I've already scanned one of them. In order to actually get any more out of it, I need to deconstruct them. Uh, oh, like de deconstruct tools? Uh, kind of. It'll give me one of the base elements, not the tool element. Bombcraft is weird. I, I think I... Okay. Uh, so it looks like I thought this was a, a witchery thing, but I just learned the research uh, doing doing my little bullshit here for the wispy dream catcher. I thought it was a, a witchery thing. It's actually not. You gave me knowledge about taint. Oh. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, if you hold the green dream catcher in your hot bar, uh, damage from taint or tainted creatures has an eighty percent chance per tick of not affecting. Damn. Uh, it makes it much, much safer if you have this thing on your hot bar to travel through tainted area. Huh. Not safe, just safer. <laughs> oh, I mean, things can still hurt you, but it basically it makes the enemies and the, the, the land itself hurt you a lot less, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
I have so many things I need to build. I'm just now getting around to making uh hold on, I just need to go I'm just going to go strip mining some more. I need more materials. <laughs> so it's fine, isn't it? Yes. I have to get all stones nice. But I have to get so much copper or ten. I'm making a beacon. So I have regen. Okay. And I have enough to make like a second tier beacon. But I only have enough in diamond and iron, which I kind of want to use. <laughs> so we are. So put this stuff in there. Okay. And just so you know, if you ever do decide to do thumb grass, I finally figured it out. The the basic bullshit that you need to know to do anything in the entire fucking mod. The thermal meter, the table, the research bench, and the arcade work table are all under the artifice tab. Nice. Really you would think the basic shit would be on the basic tab, but yeah. it's three tabs down from that. But I really hope that the silver ore is usable. I don't think it is, so we're going to run. What about blocks of redstone? Are blocks of redstone usable for a beacon basis? I don't think so. I don't think so either. In this mod pack, the best use for redstone is, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, burning it for, uh, da -da 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 haste on tools. Yeah. <laughs> There are no monsters in the mining dimension, right? I'm pretty sure there's not. I have not yet seen any. No, I have seen players die while I was in the mining dimension, so I feel like the player mobs might spawn in the mining dimension. I'm not sure, though. That is a fair thing. I'm pretty sure there's no monsters. I feel like I read something about the reason or something. By all means, stay armed. Yeah, just in case one of y'all decide to attack me. Alrighty. Also that. Oh, 
cooked it all my cold. Oh, son of a plain TT monster. Son of a I don't plain. know, but things keep disappearing randomly. They usually come back, but yeah. Yeah, you'll find them every now and then, and then it's just like, you know, oh, hey. <laughs> There's 27 things gone today that you didn't know you were missing. Oh, I see. Yes. I see, you said, you said Quicksilver tools were really good, right? Durable. They were really durable for, like, the hammer and, like, all the, all the, uh, uh, the, the addition stuff. Like, when it comes to... Durability is really what you want for every non-sword thing. Yeah, so like when it comes to like the hammer, the excavator, the lumber tool, uh, pickaxes, axes, shovels, all that shit. It's really good durability. Other than that, like it's kind of just it's the same as some other stuff. You had a basic three possible modifiers, right? Yeah. All right. So with that high durability, that's uh, that's, uh, haste, block, and mending. That's a perfect hammer, you know? Yeah. I mean, that's pretty much what I got. I got a, or I have an Illuminite ha hammer with Moss 2, maxed out redstone, or not maxed out redstone, the base haste, uh, maxed out fortune, um, and then all yeah. the smell. I mean, that's, that's probably what I would do. If, if you include the three possible... Uh, upgrades, which does, I, the last one does require a nether star, so that's like a fucking god tool. Uh, Actually, there are four potential upgrades, because the golden oh, head... Oh, Yeah, the golden head is... What is the golden head? I, I don't... It's a craftable uh, substitute for, like, a god apple. It uses a player head, some gold... And it's like, it's a little better than the God Apple. But I don't remember by how much. But one of those can be used to add a new slot now, too? Yep. Alright, so if we exclude the Nether Star one, that's three fairly easy to get upgrades then. Uh, For a total of six. Yes. I would go with, yeah, Mending 2. Uh, luck three, which is the max, and then two tiers of haste. Or one tier of haste. To fill that out, you know? Yeah, that's essentially what I got on my hammer right now. Except for I added auto smell. Who the fuck do you already have another star for four slots? Uh, so I started with three. And I did the two modifiers that gave me five, and that's where all five of my modifiers went. So I did the... Uh, I didn't do, I didn't do whatever the fuck you're saying I did, the Nether Star one. Um, but I did do... Yeah, well, what I was saying is, like, my, the, the list that I just said was with... A Nether Star, yeah, no, but I used the Diamond Block, um, oh, fuck, Diamond Block and something, and then the Gold Block and a Diamond. Yeah, um, so you only got the one tier of haste, not the second one from... Yeah, yeah, I only have, I only have the one tier. Okay. Well, I might end up using an iron thing. That was pretty, pretty good in the iron department. Okay, here we go. We're stuck in a thing. There we go. I feel like, honestly, you could probably get away with only one tier of mending on a tool of that much durability. Yeah, yeah you probably could. And then you could have Ace 3, uh, Luck 3, Auto Smells, you know? Oh man, does anyone have, like, one... Ah, oh, nah, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We're fine, we're vibing. Of course, none of the tools that I was given are the ones that I need. Why would they be? Yeah, why would they be? Come on, Nick. Uh, for, for the arcane workbench, um, I need a golden axe and a uh, and a golden hoe. Huh? 
literally the two tools I was not given. Nice. I know, okay, it looks like for one of the slots, I can use either a hoe or a shuffle, so it looks like I got one of them, at least. Nice. Yeah. Alright, golden axe. Because I need this fucking deconstruction table. Yeah. And gold glass chalk. So I can do that. Snip that. And grab some shards and some gold. Is it bad that at this point, honestly, getting glass is the most annoying part of this? Yeah, because I don't think any of us have even bothered making a shovel. Well, I mean, I now have a gold shovel that you gave me. Yeah, I mean, that's that's a that's a helpful thing for you. Mm-hmm. Uh, teleporter... Right. Second thumb here. Now I need a table, which is slabs and, and wood. Where the fuck is all my wood? According to him, it's in your mom. <laughs> Gross. Okay. Yeah. Okay, there it is. You need five glass and three obsidian. And I need to go back to how I started this video. I need one more stupid Wither Skeleton Skull. Insufficient V's. The fuck do you mean insufficient V's? <laughs> I gotta go no heading. Ah, oh, fine. My wand is not charged enough to make this bullshit. You know, that sounds honestly amazing. That sounds like the perfect time. Doesn't it? Will it? Uh, I was just being a smart aleck. I was saying that that sounds fun. Uh, very fun. Yes. through a wall and died. Oh, don't do that. I'm trying not to. Oh no, it just exploded. But if it could not... That would be nice. Okay, that just did 38 damage to that skeleton. Damn. 
such a wonderful thing. Well, at some point, this stops becoming for mobs and starts becoming for players. Wait, what? 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 I do not have... Ah, hi, skeleton! What? Okay, you're just gonna you're just gonna turn around right in the middle of the zombie pig man. Dickhead. Alright, <sighs> let's reach in some health. Stupid wheeler skeletons. Fucked my shit. I it do happens. not appreciate it. Barbara. Barbara. Fucking Barbara. I don't know what you expected. Uh, I don't know. I feel like there should be a node containing fire based V somewhere. Somewhere in this fucking desert. Uh, that would be nice, wouldn't it? It really would. Fucking Jeb Jeb. Yeah. Two things you can always count on. These, these are dumb. Barbara burning to death and Jeb Jeb suffocating. There are no nodes anywhere near my house. This this is a problem. This is definitely a problem. Um, why who did they all just burn that? Well, the up. Can, can one person just drop a wither skeleton skull? Whose grave is this? Salgo underscore six six six. Probably mine, yeah. Had nothing in it, you broke ass bitch. I mean, I collected all the graves that actually had shit in them. I mean, I guess, but. What about the graves? <laughs> what about so I could do some grave robbing, man? I can't grave rob anymore. I mean, there are several graves around there. I mean, if you're if you're in the Nether and you're seeing my graves, there's probably a chest nearby actually where I just dumped a whole bunch of shit that I couldn't carry back. Yeah. I mean, that was all the shit from those graves that I was not able to carry back with me. It's fucking cold. 
course it was. Everybody, come here with your dumb AI. Oh, and there's my final school. Thank the Lord in heaven. You know, where are you going to go fight the weather? Why would you do this? Why would I go fight the weather? Why? Why? Because I need another star for a beacon? I actually. Why do, you need a beacon? Why do I need a beacon? For blood magic? Why? What magic? Um, because oh. your mom gay. I see. Yeah. Seems logical. Yeah, I, th I thought so. I just need oh. some soul sand. Which should be easy unless you stole all the ones from that bottom area. I did not. I was talking to the na na na. Because I'm pretty sure she... yeah. I thought you said you took this one. Yeah. Oh my gosh, just straight up hitting, like, something with my bow. Oh my god, hello death noises. Uh, just straight up hitting something with my bow does five hearts of damage. That's, that's beautiful. I see. Okay. Now to find Why are fucking nodes so uncommon in this world? Uh, I don't know. Where are they at? I also don't know that. Also, this flower plains that my house is on, if you go the right direction, goes for like 3,000 more blocks. I love that. That is that is a ten out of ten thing right there. That's a more. That's also a more. These are all blocks. The things I do. Oh, I need to get obsidian too. Anyone have three obsidian? Just three. Uh, no, unfortunately. Fudge. The only city I have is tiles and totems. I mean, hey, there's some obsidian outside my house if you can figure out how to break it. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> I'd rather not. <laughs> Good try. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you mean. Well, I definitely don't know what I mean either. I'm just a rambling madman. Well, we all knew that. Okay, so I'll get the star. I wonder if I kill it with the hammer, if it has a... Because I have the hammer has fortune three and looting three on it. Because technically it does, you know, the lapis works for both. Um, mm -hmm. And so I wonder if if I hit the last blow, if my looting three will yeah. hit more. Yeah, that totally works. Let oh, up. by the way, you wanted obsidian. I just had a whole bunch of obsidian. I will to be there real soon. I lied, I forgot that Skystone is a different thing from Obsidian. I just felt like five meteors all next to each other. I see. That makes sense. Does it though? Does it though? I don't know. I am, I am like... The loot for this shit's in the center, right? Yeah, yeah. Although I have all three inscription presses. Or all three, yeah, all three presses, because I'm gonna, I think after I get started on blood magic, which having this beacon, oh my god, is gonna make it so much easier. You know, there are 
easier ways to get re reiteration. But. Uh, less. I mean, these are. This is stupid, stupidly sustainable, though. Fair. Like, I mean, I could just eat my infinite berries that grow. Like, <laughs> this is just faster. <laughs> There we are. <coughs> yeah, so I have no idea what the fuck these chests do. Are these uh, presses? Uh, they're what you use. I. We can go through some tech mods together. We'll, we'll or applied energy, inter energistics. I can explain it as as I go, as I stutter twenty million times. Jesus. All right, and this is going to be. You know what? Let's let, we can fight the weather here. We'll fight the weather underneath this village. That seems like a bad plan. Uh, well, I'm going down to uh ah. Uh, Going down to bedrock. So So I know you said you had all three presses, but I just found more than three presses. Oh, sorry, I have all four. It should be the silicon inscribing um, engineering and logic press. Yep. Those are the three I just found here. And, like, you, you want to give me a quick rundown here? Instead of just leaving me hanging and telling me what the fuck these things do? Um, okay. Just give me a sec. Essentially, what they do is you use something called an inscriber, and, um, when you use that, you um, you make different. It's it's just you use stuff to make stuff like uh, calculation, um, logic piece. Oh fuck, I'm forgetting what they're called. Circuits. You use them to make circuits when you're doing I, applied energistic stuff. I now have two logic presses, two engineering presses, a calculation press, and a silicon press. Yeah, that's you. That's all you will need. Um, so yeah, there you go. That's all, right. that's all you need to get started in whatever it's called. Oh, fire creeper. What are shiny nuggets? That's some. What's the mod? Uh, same thing. Applied energistics. Yes, let's to make it's a it's a type of. It was it's basically the same a variation of iron. Oh, it is a thermal foundation, actually. But yes, because it makes invar, which you have makes invar. Okay. And it's just like another thing to make you grind. Of course. Okay. Did anyone want to help me fight a weather? No. I'm not prepared to do that. Okay. Then you know what? Fuck it, I'm going along. But I'm not prepared. That's, that's fine. I am currently making our battlefield here. Me and you. Uh, no, I should be pretty good. We're just going to make ourselves a long chamber, and then uh, mob griefing is going to be off while we do this, okay? Because yeah. otherwise it cheeses the weather so hard it's not even funny. Okay, slash game, rule, mob griefing, crew. Oh, we got a Yeah, ready? Oh, sorry, I'm 
Do you want me to, yeah, here. My, my OCD needs this to be a square, then. I apologize. Alright. Alright, you ready? God, you're not going to give me any space to fly or anything in here? Or it will make stuff to fly. Just fly up in the central shaft where the torch is. Fair. That's say, because I, I don't want to be, like, immediately in blasting range of the fucking weather. I want to be able to drop in and hit it. I'm good whenever that. All right. Let us fly up. And take aim. Ooh, let's not hit you. All right, we're just going to go back. Oh, I can't see it. There we are. Hi, buddy. Oh, whoa. Oops. Oh, fuck. Fly up. Is everything doing? Oh, well, I was not a blaze when I teleported to you. <laughs> Hold on. Hello. Do I have a Wi-Fi chance? Oh man, he is following me up. I don't like this. Well, alright, we're about to have an interesting fight. Wait, you opened the world? You? Yep. Oh shit. Oh shit. What did you do? What did you do? Well, I have no way to fly now. Hold on. Uh, I don't either. You know, I was about to say the wither's a joke. <laughs> and then... I mean, honestly, you built a really, really fucking bad place to fight the wither. Like, you don't want to fight the wither in a closed-in hole like this. You want to fight it in the open, where you can dodge. Uh, well, I thought I could do enough damage to kill it fast enough that that did not matter. Uh, I was wrong. Alright, I do have some stuff to fly, so I'm going to... And then fly my way back, because that weather boy is still here. Let me know when you are close enough to the ground that I can drop in. I cannot fly anymore, though. Yes. Let me... Alright, you can come by. Oh, fuck, you're a ghast? Yep. You're not fitting down that hole, Daniel. I know, but my goal, because he's, oh, who, who the frick? Oh, oh, of course, there's like ten zombies here. I guess I'll, I'll kill these enemies that are on the surface here. Okay, so let's just transform back into myself, and we'll just slowly drop down. Oh my gosh, he's regening like a motherfucker. Yeah. He's also hitting me from where he's at. Oh, okay, thank God. You got him? Yes, but where's my stupid star? Where's the star? Did it fall down? I don't know, but I'm about to go down there. Drink, I, do I not have a regular? Okay. Alright, fire bad it is. Meanwhile, I'm doing it the plebe way. It did fall down. Alright, uh, would you like me to give you the division sigil? Uh, I don't remember what the fuck that's for, but... It's for making, I'm... like, stuff like the Angel Ring. Oh, yes, I would very much like that. Uh, also, um... Uh, also, I, I am I, now... I, I flew down there and just picked it up. I didn't see that you were going down there. But there's your division sigil, sir. Thank you. You are welcome. 
And there we go. I must. I must. Perform the activation ritual. I vaguely remember this. Uh, before you use that nether star, would you mind if I scan it? Uh, yes. Teleport to carry. I am here. Oh, hey. Okay. There you go. Thank you very much. That gives me a ton of research for like eight different things. You are welcome. There's also an Enderman who is just teleporting around violently. Yeah, he wants to eat my face. He, he now wants to eat my face. He's a blinding Enderman. Oh, interesting. Where's this fucker at? I don't know. He teleported again. I hear him. There he is. Hi, right, buddy. Oh, bye, buddy. Damn it, he is teleporting around, like, violently. Alright, I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't remember what does what. I don't remember how you do this fucking activation ritual. I guess I'm gonna oh, go it's, Okay, so enchantment table and Please do it in an open plane, because you will destroy, literally... It'll create what's called Cursed Earth, which is great for, like, woods, where like skeleton farming, but you need self touch to pick it up. So you need a enchantment table, eight redstone, and then kill something on the eight redstone that surrounds it once it hits midnight. Oh, uh, yes. And it creates a whole bunch of Cursed Earth, but honestly, it's not that bad of a thing. Uh, yeah. I just need to go to port codex. And now I need to go kill the blaze. And then once it's activated. Yeah, once it's activated, you don't need to use it again. A diamond and an iron, right? Um, mixed. I don't remember how to make an unstable ingot. I can look it up. Yeah, I just did. And the ink, I need two of them for the angel ring. So I need two iron, two diamonds. And the whole thing with the unstable ingots is I have to craft them into something else within like. One minute or they explode. Ten right? seconds. Ten seconds. Oh, it's even worse. Did you expect it to be easy? Interesting. What the fuck do they have unstable blocks? I I know, I saw that. It is not an okay thing. Why? The the flavor text for the unstable idiot is: Have you ever tried to divide by diamond? Of course not, because you're a sane and rational person who would never do something like that. Yep. <laughs> I have to wonder if the unstable ingot lock is actually, even though it's set, still is called unstable, I have to wonder if it's actually a stable way to store unstable ingots. You know? I don't think it is. I do think it does reset the timer, though. I mean, you can always go into a test world and check it, but... Yeah. I feel like those kinds of experiments are more fun done in... Uh, in uh, standard play. Oh yeah, almost definitely. What does the destruction pickaxe do again? Uh, you know the bound pickaxe? Think like a less um, overpowered version of that. Okay, I have 15 diamond well, blocks. I kind of figured, figured that would be what it is, but like, what's the area, do you know? No, I 
don't. The bottom pickaxe is something stupid, like a 16 by 16 yeah, or something like that. It is a 16 by 16. Yeah, it's so much that you would never actually want to dig that much at one time. I mean, unless you're strip mining. That's the only good use for that. Yep, I have to empty out my inventory. <coughs> Ugh, proper inventory sword storage is so hard. Tools made of unstable ingots don't have durability, right? Nope. Alright, I have to decide now which which uh, angel ring I'm gonna try and go for this time. Which what? Which angel ring? Oh. Uh, there's an unstable ingot builder's wand? Yeah. What does it do? It's just the same. It's the same as the super builder's wand, except for less amount. Less of, like, there's just less you can do with it. Uh, you can't. A lot of these other things, too, I don't remember. Like, I mean, the shovel, the pickaxe are all pretty obvious. What the fuck is the healing axe, dude? Uh, that's honestly the only other. Like, the healing axe, it just gives you a passive regen effect. It'd be what I would use. Oh, I should probably. And what about the reversing hoe? The fuck does the reversing hoe do? I could not tell you that one. Does it make things back into grass? That's what it sounds like it does. Your your guess is honestly as good as mine at this point. Huh? I think I'm honestly just gonna go for the invisible rings this time for the angel rings. Yeah. Um, 